Oh, good. You're coming around. I didn't expect you to conk out like that. Scared me half to death. About that. We are at my place. In the yard. Don't you remember? Ugh, keep it together, would you? Oh, gosh. You're not kidding, are you? Goku, please be kidding. Did you hit your head? Catch a cold? Tell me you at least know who you are. Why, you're Goku, of course. And this charade's gone on long enough. Here, the evidence. Look in the mirror. Judging from your reaction, you're not really him, are you? But you're Goku on the outside, that's for sure. Did you get amnesia? Oh, I give up. You chose a great time to clock out, Goku. There you are. Now what? Who is it? Wait, you're... But how in the... Android 16? Is that you? Mm-hmm. Cell destroyed you? How are you operational? Wait, did the Dragon Balls bring you back? What in the world could all this mean? I'm going to need some answers. Well, this is the part where you give me the answers. Ugh, remember when Cell smacked you around and I so graciously repaired you? It was not me you repaired, but another 16. What? You who are linked to Goku. There is much to be done. Should you decide to resist, I will force you to comply. Uh, Goku, I don't know what's going on, but you better kick this imposter's bionic butt! Uh, hold the phone! You know how to fight, right? Wrong! This is turning out to be a bad, bad day! That body is Goku's. It's bound to be just as hardy. Do not worry. I will utilize less than lethal force. Your termination would be disadvantageous. Watch out! Your strength is congruent with my data. And I need not hold back. Though but moments after the link, your strength has already matured. Huh? Salutations, Bulma. What exotic cuisines have you prepared for us today? 
Well, whatever it might possibly be, it better be worth the trip. Oh, who's the bruiser? He's certainly not human from what I can tell. Threat detected. Recommended course of action, abort. Goku, just know this. I will return. So, he's gone? Just like that? Hmm. Just like that, huh? Hey, you inside Goku. The jig is up. It's not possible to fool a god. So, you mean to say he's not Goku after all? My, my. This is intriguing. It is Goku, physically speaking, but his power is awfully weak. What's left over has someone else's power. If I were to put it simply, there is another person in his body. Uh, no way! He's... possessed? You hear me in there, you squatter! Get out! Now! Goku's got his work cut out. He doesn't need to be playing host to you! Bulma, please mind your temper. You see, this predicament isn't how our poor friend's doing. Ahem. <clears throat> Yoo-hoo, you in there. Can you hear me? Can. You. Hear. Me. Goku is in there somewhere. Mind getting him for us? He's sleeping, of course, but since you share the same body, you should be able to wake him. Let me ask you, Whis. Do these waves appear to be acting strangely? So you felt them too, Lord Beerus. Indeed, they seem to be man-made. Waves? What waves? Now there, you're telling me you can't feel that? How dense are you? As dense as any other human. How rude are you? Hmm. Then you rang us up for another reason, I take it. Because I thought you were whining and dining us for info about these waves. Wait a sec. That's right. I totally forgot. The world is in absolute peril. First, Goku clones start popping up all around the world, making a mess. Wasn't enough Frieza and Cell are back. It's utter chaos, I tell you. Oh. Oh. How about oh no, the Earth is doomed. But now that you're here, you can thrash him for us. It really is none of my business, you know. Please go and get those tasty tidbits you prepared earlier. Oh, great. We're on our own. I must say, though, these waves do elicit some concern. What's this? Goku's energy just got a tad stronger. It seems our new friend was able to get in touch with Goku. Hello? 
Goku? Are you able to move in there yet? It's the funniest thing. I want to wake up, mostly because I'm super starving, but I just can't seem to do it. There's no exit here either, and smashing my way out doesn't seem to be an option. Man, this is super weird. Am I dreaming or something? Since there's no response from Goku, it's safe to assume he can't move. Huh? Wait, Whis, you can't hear me either? Hello? But I can hear Whis just fine. Man, I'm in a bit of a pickle, aren't I? Perhaps these bothersome waves have something to do with Goku's current condition. I would surmise they are suppressing his power, forcing our Saiyan friend's consciousness into a state of hibernation. It's the only explanation. Then other fighters with strong energy are likely experiencing the same results. But how are you two able to bicker about food unaffected? Please, we're gods. To us, these kinds of waves are completely harmless. Lucky me. We need to come up with a solution, or Goku will be out to lunch indefinitely. Then we better come up with one fast. <gasps> Hold on. The rest of the gang went out to scope the damage across the world. But... If these waves affect the strong, then I guess that means... They got paralyzed along the way. Or got body snatched like Goku did over here. Oh, man! What are we gonna do? If everyone's knocked out! This is our greatest crisis yet, hands down! Stopping those waves is our only chance at correcting this matter. Boma, might you have an idea as to what's causing them? Hmm, that's a toughie. Uh, but wait! Oh, did you finally remember something? Yeah. Why did Sixteen show up earlier? He was also talking about someone being linked to Goku. I think there's a connection here. There's gotta be. It's a lead. You might as well follow it and see where it leads you. Right. Let's get to the bottom of this. Come on, guys. The rest of our crew needs to be saved as well. Can't do it alone, though. I'll need some muscle. Just to reiterate, we're not helping, understand? Aw, oh, don't be so cold. I'll prepare a meal so good it'll blow your godly taste buds away. Did I not make myself clear? We're not lifting a finger, lady. If you need help, you might get a better response by asking the soul inside Goku. Huh? He's got control of Goku's body, right? Well, then he can do the fighting for you. Hmm, there's no other choice, is there? Plus, you probably need to get back to your own body anyway. Well, then it's settled. Welcome aboard! another guy with Goku's face surprised you. There are loads of those clones all over the place now. Who knows when another one will attack? You better stay alert, pure me soul inside Goku. Oh, before I forget, 
there's some good news for the both of you. I managed to analyze those mysterious waves and mod this plane to neutralize them. If everything goes according to plan, we should be able to free Goku's consciousness. In other words, the old Goku should be back soon. Well, we've got nothing to lose. Ha! In the outside world! Awesome! Oh, right! It worked! Wait, something's not right. My body, it feels... It feels all heavy and weak. <laughs> I knew it. I'm as weak as a kitten. I won't be fighting like this, that's for sure. Man... The wave neutralizer still has some kinks. I guess it'll be a while until we can restore your strength. Or maybe we could skip all that and use the Dragon Balls to fix this whole mess. You can do that, right, Bulma? You can do anything! No can do. The Dragon Balls are stone, remember? They might as well be bowling balls. Oh, right. I totally forgot about that. Uh, you forgot, huh? I guess you really are, Goku. Anyway, soul inside Goku, were you listening? I trust you got all that. Until we can restore the real Goku's power, we're going to need you on battle duty. Okay, time for us to go find 16 and save our friends! Hey, I feel something. It's faint, but is that someone's power? Yeah, it is. I'm sure of it. Krillin! Come on! We gotta save it! It's Krillin! We found him! Is that a clone? No! It's going after Krillin! I've got to save him! Oh, hey there, Goku. <laughs> huh? Krillin, you finally come around. I thought you were a goner. Uh, say, where are we? Is this Bulma's airplane? The last thing I remember is investigating the origin of the clones. Then I got all dizzy. Let's see. Nah, it's no good. I can't recall anything after that. So did you save me, Goku? <laughs> yeah. Thanks, Goku. You never let me down. No need to thank me, it's nothing. After all, whenever I'm in a pinch, who's the guy who's always there to throw me a sensu bean? <laughs> well, sometimes I think I'd rather be the one eating them, though. <laughs> so, who did this to me? I can't remember a thing. A lot's gone on, Krillin, and not much of it good. Now, where to begin? I told you a lot happened. Yeah, I never would have imagined. Look, I'm glad Android 16 is alive, but I just wish he wasn't our enemy. Anyway, I've decided. I want to help out, and I kind of want to find out what 16 was really up to. So I'm going to fight too, if that's okay with you, Goku. Sure, fine by me. You forgetting something? Haven't you guys, like, lost your power? Oh, yeah. I guess it must have slipped my mind. I imagine a little more training might restore some of my power, but I would still be in no state to fight by myself. Huh? 
Wait a minute. So does this mean I can't fight either? Hmm. I might just have an idea. But we need that soul inside Goku to agree. What do you say? Do you think you can move from Goku over to Krillin? <laughs> what? So whatever's inside Goku is gonna link with me? Krillin! Both of you, close your eyes and take a deep breath. Okay, now it's your turn. Try moving to Krillin. Whoa! So are you, like, out of my body now? <laughs> There's a stranger inside my body! It worked! You changed who you're linked with! Now everybody can fight! So, does that mean when Krillin's out there fighting, I have to just wait on the sidelines and not do anything? If only one Link can exist at a time, then I guess so. But if we can get more people to join us, it'll relieve some of the strain on Goku. Well, we can't just rely on Goku all the time. Now can we? Hmm. Yes, I don't mind. It's not like I was really doing the fighting myself anyway. I'll just have to make do with some image training. That is, until I get the chance to fight again. Only you would think of that, Goku. Anyway, I guess we'll all have to work together from now on. <laughs> nice! I think you're getting the hang of it. Hey! You there, my body! You're a pretty darn good fighter, you know that? Hope 18 and Marin are okay. They're back at Master Roshi's place. With this many baddies around, it could spell trouble. I wouldn't worry. I mean, 18's stronger than you, right? may be true, but you don't have to put it so bluntly. <laughs> oh yeah, sorry. <laughs> hey, Krillin! There's some kind of huge power out there. Feel it? Yeah, I did. It's different. It's not like the clones we've been fighting. I wonder, is it... so? Could be. The energy is similar to cells, yes, but it feels a bit smaller, doesn't it? That's odd. We can sense cells' energy, but not the person he's fighting with. An opponent with no energy? Hey, do you think maybe cells fighting 16? Wait, I've got it. He's an android. You can't sense the energy of an android. We might be able to find a clue or two. I say we check it out. I knew it. Cell. And his opponent is down. Um, excuse me, what's going on here? What have you done to my wife? If it isn't Goku and his annoying, noseless sidekick. Cell, 
Holy crap! You are back! That's awesome. To tell the truth, I always did want another go at you. <laughs> Glad to hear it. Because I'm back from the dead and ready to bury you in your wretched offspring. Krill! Let me take care of Cell right now. You need to make sure 18's okay. Thanks, Goku. It's no good. She's out cold. Oh my, do you know her? Is she okay? I'm so sorry. She sacrificed herself to save me. You monster! Cell! You'll pay for this! <laughs> Look at this spectacle she's putting on. So be it. We'll just have to defeat them all right here, right now. Well, I gotta say, I am happy that I'm getting a chance to fight Goku so soon. Sorry, stranger, but I'm gonna need you to look after 18 for me. Cause I'm gonna kick Cell's butt! Don't make me laugh. Defeat me. As I recall, your power doesn't even compare to that of your better half, HG. Back down, Krillin! This isn't the kind of guy you want to tangle with! What is a husband if he can't protect his wife? Ooh! <laughs> Someone's coming. Damn right! I don't care how strong you are! Touch my wife, you're going down! Feel his power either. He's gone. He got away. Eighteen, are you okay? It's okay. Don't worry. She's just unconscious. But we'd better get her looked at just to be on the safe side. Yeah, I guess so. Hey, thanks so much for standing up for eighteen. No, it's me who should be thanking you. You're quite strong, the both of you, really. Especially considering you managed to withstand the effects of the waves. Waves? Do you know what's going on? Oh, uh... What happened to 18? Please, I need to know what happened! clearly instructed her to stay indoors, if she'd only listened! Very well. I was a researcher, a once proud employee of the Red Ribbon Army. Unfortunately, after those waves disabled 18, the army abducted her. As to why she was abducted, I honestly don't know. Yeah, but what about the clones? And Cell coming back? Hey, is the army...? Yes. The army is behind everything. I was researching tech that can suppress a fighter's power, allowing us to plant the spirit of another inside. The technical term is called linking, and it was perfected not days ago. Shamefully, when I learned the army planned to use it for total cosmic domination, I became afraid and deserted. While on the run, I met Android 18, 
We decided to flee together. Then we... we ran into Cell. Eighteen sacrificed herself to save me. So I guess what you're trying to say is that the Red Ribbon Army is up to their dirty old ways again. And when you tried to quit, they turned on you, tried to hunt you down. Does that sound about right? Yes. Please, you must stop the army. Damn straight you will. Why, we'll tear them to, to, to ribbons. So, you know where their base is, right? We would be very grateful if you showed us the way. I'm sorry, but I wouldn't be able to retrace my steps. I was so caught up in getting away. Ah, uh, great. Oh, by the way, we're gonna go see my friend Bulma. Wanna tag along? You see, the plan is we're gonna have her take a look at 18. All things considered, you'd probably be much safer with us. Actually... I really should be heading home. I'm worried about my family. Don't worry about me. Finding the base, that must be your top priority. Yeah, whatever you say. Blast it all! How is this possible? Why aren't their powers as diminished as mine are? This isn't fair. How can I, the perfect being, be defeated? <laughs> A sorry sight you were, Sel. Frieza. Hope you don't mind me observing this delightful spectacle from afar. Will the love be added? A deal you chose to ignore just so you could run off on your own and fail miserably. Tell me, how was your showdown with that filthy primate? <laughs> I don't have to tell you anything. <laughs> so that's how it is. Well, perhaps we can strike a deal. My subordinates have acquired information that might be of some small interest to you. Oh, by subordinates, I assume you mean that over-choreographed circus troupe? What an embarrassment they are to your cause. I'm sure you're very proud. Uh, but yes. They are called the Ginyu Force. Does this not entice you? My precious intel, that is. What say you to a deal? Tell me what you know, and I'd be happy to tell you what I know. If you're referring to the waves and that linking business, then I already know about all of that. Huh? But I didn't even... Look, I'd rather not listen to you explain. It's easier just to read your mind. You read my mind? You see, Piccolo used to be common. Reading minds is just old hat to him. Hey, just 
Which what else did you look at without my permission, huh? Don't tell me. You saw memories of me taking a bath, didn't you? I might have seen something like that amongst the jungle. What of it? What's that supposed to mean? Have you no respect for a girl's privacy? Hold up. Why would a Namekian be interested in girls anyway, Bulma? Hold on there. Aren't you a little too old to be calling yourself a girl? I am not old! <clears throat> At least now I know the state of affairs. Go Hold on, so you're linked with Goku? Well, you've really gotten yourself into a nasty situation. Still, I'm gonna need you now more than ever. I'll join the fight from here, whatever I can do to help. We're running some tests on 18 over at the Capsule Corporation. There's nothing wrong with her physically, so she should come around soon. It's gonna be okay. Relax, Krillin. You look like it's the end of the world. Well, it kinda is. And I take your word over Doom and Bloom any day. Thanks, Palma. <laughs> some contraption together to wake 18 right up. Excuse me? Let's be clear, I'm not a walking gadget factory. But you're always tinkering with weird doodads and gizmos. Uh, doodads? These are inventions, thank you very much. <laughs> Listening to you two puts me at ease for some reason. I don't know why. You're right. With Bulma on the job, 18 will be up and operational, no problem. You know it! Don't worry, 18's in good hands. You just leave her to me. The thing that's puzzling me right now is Android 16's role in this whole dilemma. The 16 I know wouldn't go along with the Red Ribbon Army's twisted way of doing things. It's true. 16 was never one of the bad guys. When Android 16 first showed up on the scene, he did talk about another 16. I wonder if the 16 I saw was a copy built with the original specs. Maybe, but I don't know. He didn't seem like a completely different Android. You have a point. Okay, okay. What if he is a copy, but with the original's memory? Who knows, Bulma? Either way, our only course of action at this point is to find the army's base. Guess you're right. Starting to get the feeling that we've just found the base. Hmm? Huh? Watch out! Somebody's coming! So, you're here at last. Sixteen, it's you! It's really you! So tell me, do you have your old memories? You do! You remember us! I can tell! So what if I do? Wait a sec. What are you saying? It means that you're the 16 that we've always known! Remember when we fought side by side all those years ago? <clears throat> Why are you helping the Red Ribbon Army? I mean, that's insane! There is no need for me to answer. Stop! No way! We don't want to fight you, 16! Just walk away from this nonsense with the strange waves and the clones! 
Your motives are not relevant. If you will not engage, I will. I knew it! You never planned on killing us after all, did you? Right from the start, you lacked that killer instinct. Had you figured in a flash. It's like Goku says, 16 isn't fighting because he wants to. And if he's being controlled by the army, that means we can be friends again. Apologies, but I cannot leave the army. I cannot let that monster run amok. Monster? Yes, the Red Ribbon Army's current leader, Android... 21. You're saying there's an Android 21? There is. I have been complying with 21's orders. However, 21's personality is growing more savage by the day. Were I to leave my post... Exactly. If you were to leave your post, she would never awaken again. Hey! You're the researcher from before! 21. What in the world? She's 21? Curiouser and curiouser. But if you're Android 21, why did you save 18 back there? Save her? Please, I never saved her. I fed you those lies in order to avoid fighting. I'm not at full power as of yet, but if you formed an alliance with Cell, that could prove troublesome. As for you, 16, I've had enough. You're... You're nothing more than a treacherous pile of slag. I don't understand. Like hell you don't. I know you activated the system. Also, to give these nitwits an advantage, I know you linked a compatible soul. And if I did? Oh, using that tone with me? I thought my policy on this matter was clear continue to resist me, I will make sure that she is history. <clears throat> I see you still intend to side with the organics. So sad. Such wasted effort. Twenty-one's true form. Nora? So she wasn't even human after all? That was established pretty early, Goku. Such a shame you must part ways so soon. I guess this is farewell. Those who stand in my way will be ripped into tiny pieces. Don't hate me. Keep your hate Believe me, such a defective personality. Sixteen, get out of there! You'll be blown to bits! Hold on! I'll save you! No, Krillin! Step aside! Hear me in there? I'm gonna need your help with this one. Hummy, hummy, ha! And do it! Stretch. No, it can't be. Sixteen, we 
We were just reunited! Oh, are you crying for Sweet Sixteen? Oh, don't be sad. It's gonna be all right. Cause I'm gonna eat you right up. <laughs> that last attack must have taken its toll. What's the matter? You were on a bit of a roll there. You'll get what's coming to you. We'll finish this later. Wait! Why did you destroy Sixteen? I thought he was on your side! He didn't listen, so I punished him, of course. If he stopped while he was ahead, I would have let him live, but he had to cross the line. Oh well, that's fine. Now there is no one left to oppose me. And now I'm free! Free to stuff myself with as many sweets as I want! Hmm. <laughs> you sound like a spoiled brat. You'll see, boys. As soon as I'm ready, that's when the real fun starts! Oh no, you don't! Get back here! Goku! Let's tail him, Krillin! We can't let anything happen to Goku or his new friend! Wasting my time. Finally, can't stand the people. You've never heard of me, you say? Then please, allow me to enlighten you. My name is Seth. A truly perfect being, the ultimate android created by Dr. Jerome. But more to the point, who in the hell are you? What is a living human soul doing inside of me? This is upsetting. <laughs> We can discuss this at a later time. For now, we have a fight to go and win. who was linked with Goku earlier. Oh, it was the impact of that blast that sent you here, didn't it? Well, more fun for me, I suppose. And it saves me the trouble of hunting you down. become stronger. I could gobble you completely whole right now. But maybe I should have you relink with Goku instead. Yes, he would be a much better meal. Oh, decisions, decisions. We have no choice. We must retreat. From the amount of his fatigue, the link won't hold for much longer. So, you can run all you like. 
I'll be dining on you before sundown. How is this even? She's on a completely different level than my power can handle. No power source on this planet is capable of that. There must be some kind of way. Perhaps those clones are more than just mere drones. They might be the weakness I've been looking for. Whatever the case, I need to heal. And quick. said she wasn't at full power just yet. Do you think she was just bluffing? I mean, come on. A diet of junk food? It's mostly sugar and the stuff doesn't fill you up. Who cares about her dietary habits? How strong she can get. That's the problem. The problem is you guys arguing. Stop already. You guys are good at sensing power, right? Feel out 21's location and send her to the scrap heap. If only it were that simple. We've been trying to figure out where 21 is for a while, but nothing's come up, I'm afraid. Android 21. Probably keep her power in low gear, just like so. Oh well, what doesn't turn up now will turn up later, they say. For now, let's focus on what we can do. Yeah, like rounding up the rest of the gang, right? Yeah, Krillin's right. We need a bigger team for the battle ahead. Just our luck. Vegeta's good at never being around when you really need him. He brags about being the Prince of Saiyans. He's the Prince of Bad Timing, if you ask me. Cut him some slack, Bulma. He'll turn up soon. I sure of it. Hey! I know! I'm pretty used to this Link business by now. Maybe if I focus really hard, I can pinpoint Vegeta's energy. All right, here I go. Yep, it's Vegeta, all right. I got it! <laughs> Way to go, Goku! <laughs> Come on, guys. What do you say we go rescue our buddy Vegeta? Hmm. That's odd. Vegeta should be close by. He's got to be around here somewhere. Hey, look over there! Vegeta! Time to finish what I started! Damn! Who's there? Well, well. If it isn't the welcome wagon. 
and I was so close to it. I wanted to off this impertinent prince before that woman could turn him into an hors d'oeuvre. What is he talking about? Although, that wouldn't change your pitiful fate as the main cause, would it? In fact, I may as well exterminate all of you now! Wait, Lord Frieza, please! Allow your humble servants to assist you! The King! I guess the more things change, the more they stay the same, huh? And they do this, um, why again? Ahem. <clears throat> well, impressive. Now then, it will be my pleasure to watch all of you perish. I can see now why Cell was struggling so much. You have done quite well to tap into this much power. Sorry, Frieza. Looks like you're the one that's going to be doing the dying today. But before we blast you into microscopic pieces, you're going to tell us something. Oh, pray tell. When you said we'd be that woman's main course, what did you mean? Because as I see it, Android 21 is just trying to kill us. <laughs> Very well. I suppose I should reward you for that stimulating scuffle. No, Lord Frieza. There's no need to divulge information to the enemy. No need to worry. I merely want to fan the flame of fear that is to consume them. That woman. You refer to her as Android 21, if I am not mistaken. She fully devours warriors, which adds their strength to hers. It's a simply remarkable process. You're kidding! I'm serious. She turns her victims into candied treats. Just crude, if you want my opinion. I see. So that's what her scheme is. Heesh. I mean, talk about bizarre. That's not too different from Seller Boo. Well then, if that's the case, we're pretty lucky to have found these guys before Android 21 could gobble them down. Oh, stop all your silly nonsense. I won't become noisy for 21. More trouble before you, Cretans. Think you can get away from us, Freezer? Ah. <laughs> At once, my lord. Guldo, paralyze them! such sweet sorrow. Thank you. We'll see each other soon. <laughs> I see. A lot has happened while I was out. Still. Letting Frieza slither away like that proves you're nothing but soft. You were made painfully aware of Guldo's power when you fought him on Namek! Y yeah sorry about that. <sighs> Vegeta! I don't think 
you have room to talk right now. While you were sleeping like a Saiyan log, everyone was out fighting for the world. <laughs> Maybe we could just save the marital squabbles for later, huh? I know, I know, you're right. It's been some time since 21 flew off. Yeah, and if what Frieza said is true, 21 should be a lot stronger by now. That's right. It's high time you pull the plug on that oversized blender. Yeah, but we can't get a fix on 21's power. We don't know what we're dealing with yet. It doesn't matter how strong 21 gets. I'm sending her to the trash compactor. <sighs> there he goes again. Really, Vegeta? You were napping this whole time. You've never seen Android 21 in action. Kakarot! Just shut it! Look, we're glad you're on board, Vegeta. But you'd better get used to linking before taking on 21. Remember, without linking, we are utterly powerless. <laughs> That's certainly no way to fight. We don't know where the waves are coming from. We just have to accept it. <laughs> okay, okay. Settle down, everyone. And that goes for you too, Vegeta. Piccolo's the one who saved your butt when Frieza was about to fry you. I think you owe him some thanks. Oh, he acted on his own. I don't recall asking for help. Oh, is that how it is? Well, good. Because the thought of being thanked by you makes me want to hurl. What? What was that? <laughs> nice comeback, Vegeta. <laughs> so, uh, guys, it's time. Game plan! Let's clean up the baddies that we know are out there already. Look, we can't afford to let 21 chomp them down and then get even stronger! Good thinking. And fighting those clones, that would be some good link practice, too. The very thought of fighting with someone else in my body is just sickening. But... I'll let it slide this once. Elder Kai, what do you think? Hmm, I'm sensing something bad. Something terribly evil. Almost feels like someone took all the warriors on Earth and rolled them into one. All the warriors? And that's not all. Frieza and that android cell. Even Boo, the terrifying villains our friends defeated, seem to have returned. Boo too? Things could go completely out of control if something's not done. This is terrible. Unfortunately, we don't have a horse in this here race. The gods keep watch, plain and simple. We'll just have to believe our friends can pull through. Come on, Goku. You can do it. One to 100, I'd give it a 24. Those Ginyu losers aren't packing much power either, at least not from what I heard. Well, can't be too picky. And you, why watch from the back row? I'll give you a VIP seat. Oh, so you knew all along. Of course. Why do you think I let you watch me maul that meathead? Consider that a preview of what's gonna happen to you. <laughs> uh, 
Aren't you excited? <laughs> You're going to have a much harder time if you plan on snacking on me. Though, from the looks of it, you've been snacking a bit much as it is. You should probably dial it back a bit. You wouldn't want a bellyache now, would you? You look tastier than... who was that? Oh yes, Nappa. <laughs> I wonder what I should turn you into. What the... Don't worry, I'll be sure to make it quick. How did she get this strong? This fast! When we last tangled, I wasn't even at half power. I'd like to actually try this time, if that's okay. So let's set the table. It's time to eat! good either. I'd probably give it a solid 40. Still, it's a long ways from Cell, though. Hold on. You made Cell into a bonbon? That explains your dramatic increase in power. Bug Boy deserved it. The perfect organism, more like perfect pinhead. Oh, try not to be too hard on him. He did try his best, after all. Sadly, no amount of effort can make him understand that he was weak. Speaking of which, you're not that special yourself. You can actually crack a joke. I see your programming does extend beyond pigging out. I will have you know that I don't pig out. I'm simply blessed with a discerning palate. Good. Now that we have that cleared up, I think I'd like to eat you now. One moment. Scratch that. No. Your jokes are horrible! You'll just have to work your seven hands! Is that all such a letdown? What? It's time to eat! <laughs> That's delicious! Clones can't beat the real deal! Go organic! So fresh and flavorful! This is the best I've had yet! I'm going to give it an 80! I believe that it's time to check in on Goku and friends! They managed to wake up Vegeta. And I see they're rounding up their friends to try and beat me. I was hoping to scarf them down while they couldn't move, but this way works too. After all, food is much better when it is served fresh. Oh, I can almost taste them. Patience now, patience. I've already waited this long. Need to get stronger, and then, then the feasting can begin. Power writhing and screaming. Ah, the perfect seasoning for the perfect meal. Hi, 
I sense something, and it's huge! This energy's insane! It feels like boost, but there's more to it! Frieza, Cell, it's a mix of all the bad guys whose butts we've kicked! The sheer size can only mean one thing. It's 21. A mix of different energies. Didn't you say the same thing about Cell way back when? 21 and Cell are both androids. It's natural they would have similar energies. Interesting. So she plans to lure us in, does she? Yeah, it seems that way. Uh, you don't think she plans to eat all of us in one go? Actually, I think that was her plan. Then she's either brave or defective. Either way works for me, though. Yeah, well, I guess that saves us the trouble of having to look for her. There's only one way that we can go now. And I say we go! Let's do it! to eating, I think you Saiyans beat her hands down. Yes, and the same goes for fighting. None can challenge a Saiyan in that area. than I thought. If we're kicking it into high gear, then let's go somewhere we can really let loose. Uh, Goku! Putting the planet first, eh, Kakarot? So you're playing it safe this time. That's right, Vegeta. I'd rather fight without having to worry about making a mess. You know what I mean? You're suggesting we take the fight off the planet, right? But where? I know just the place. It'll be perfect. Everyone, grab on to me. We're going for a ride. Bye. We'll be waiting for you. Huh? And that's the story. So would you let us fight here, pretty please? It's just like you to bring trouble to my doorstep. Ugh. The sacred world of the Kais isn't your personal playground. I know, but this is the only place that came to mind. Sorry, sheesh. It would be safer to bring the fight here, but can 21 even make the journey? Yeah, she'll come. I know it think. Which is it, Goku? 
If she doesn't come, we'll just have to figure out some other kind of plan. No big deal. By the way, uh, if you don't mind me asking, what are Lord Beerus and Weiss doing here? We thought we would enjoy the show. As you predicted, Lord Beerus, they moved the final battle to this very spot. Well, I guess Earth will be staying in one piece for another day. You mortals are so predictable. It really is a shame. By the way, boys, I would turn my attention upward. Huh? It would appear Android 21 has arrived. Hmm. Do Goku and his friends stand a chance? That Android 21 is pretty powerful, honestly. This battle could go either way for our friends. I'm not so sure. <laughs> Did she break? What a smorgasbord of stuff! This is awesome! I feel like a kid in a candy store, literally! You've got back. We're the ones who are gonna chew you up! They did it! Good going, Goku! Our world is pretty sturdy, but you certainly did a number on it, Goku. Sorry about that, old guy. I'll make it up to you, maybe, someday? After all that, we still don't know who 21 was exactly or the mystery person Android 16 was trying to save. Oh my, there are still a lot of questions left unanswered. Honestly, Whis, does anyone care? It really is none of our business. However, my appetite did get going when that robot lady was talking about sweets. Well then, how about we ask Bulma to prepare us a selection of Earth's finest confections? Oh, 
Does this mean you're still not satisfied? Hey, if you want answers, you're free to look for them yourself. Please, I'll eat your share if you don't hurry. Oh dear, coming! Oh, and, uh... Do fill me in once you've pieced it all together.